How to Create Coloring Books Fast with Midjourney for Amazon KDP Tutorial. So go ahead and open up your browser. And the first thing that we want to do before creating your own coloring book is to research on Amazon. Make sure that what you're trying to do is in demand and that way your book will actually sell. So one tool that will be helpful in this step is the AMZ Suggestion Expander. AMZ Suggestion Expander expands the number of search suggestions that are shown in your Amazon search bar. So for reference, let's search now in Amazon. For example, let's type in coloring books. As you can see, there is only one column of results in here. And now let's add in the AMZ Suggestion Expander. So just click on add it as an extension. And once it's installed, refresh the Amazon. Search up the same thing, which is coloring book. And as you can see, this before and after results in red and green columns are added, as well as the others. So this is basically making our choices wider. So after searching that up, select a specific theme or specific niche of your coloring book. So for example, coloring book for adults relaxation, and then let's add in nature. And here, as you can see, there are over 30,000 results, which just means that your product will be competing with all of that. So what we need to do is to change just to make sure that we have less competitors. So let's say the same adult relaxation, but flowers specifically instead of nature. And as you can see, there is only 8,000 results, so that is a good number. Now we move on to the results itself. And as long as you can see that there are books with these orange tags that say bestseller, it could be a great choice of niche since it's garnering a lot of customers. Also, once we sort this by bestsellers, these books are actually selling a lot, so that is another great sign. Now click on a single book that has great sales and here we have a preview of what the book looks like. So the title page and the flower page as follows. Now that we know what niche to focus on, which is flowers, we now go to the next step which is creating the coloring pages itself. So go ahead and open Midjourney. So this service allows users to generate images based on textual descriptions creating a wide range of art forms. So we're going to utilize this to create our coloring pages. Once you're in their site, you need to click on the sign in and you will then be asked to log in your Discord account. So make sure that you have one since we will be using Midjourney through this Discord. Once you're logged in, your profile will show and here is the channel of Midjourney. This looks intimidating at first, but what we just need here is any of this newbie channels, wherein we can type the command for Midjourney to generate an image from our text, which is the slash imagine command. Now, as you can see, others are also generating in here, and this channel could actually be chaotic. And if you're not subscribed to any of their plans, you cannot use majority of the features. And what you generated can be used for commercial purposes. So these are their plans. They have monthly and yearly billing. Also, if you're subscribed to any of their plans, you also get a private bot wherein commands of other users will not be bothering you. So once you're in here, type in a slash followed by the word imagine and then this will show. And in this prompt is where we will type in the description of the image that we want. So since we want a coloring book, let's type that in. So coloring page followed by the subject that we want, so in our case, flower, and I want it to be specifically tulip. After that, you can also add in some adjective, like clean line art, so just we have a clean coloring book. And lastly, you can also add in aspect ratio. To do that, type in a double dash, followed by the letters AR, and then your aspect ratio, so I want it to be 2 by 3. You can also choose from 4 by 3 or 16 by 9. Or square whatever you want also there is no specific structure needed in this prompt just add in every word that will describe what image you want now this may take a while but after it's loaded 100 percent four images will show and if you already like something tap on one of this u1 u2 u3 or u4 to upscale the image and you can then download it from there but if ever you don't like the images that you have you can click on this refresh and it will generate new set of images. 
Now here below is the V1, V2, V3, and V4, which means version. So if you want another version of an image in here, click on the corresponding V number and it will then generate. Once you have your image upscale to save it, click on this web button. This will direct you to your browser where you will see the size, its date, aspect ratio, and other details. And of course, your image. From here, click on the save icon. And now, as you can see, this size is actually too small for a clear printing in Amazon. What we need to do is to make this bigger without ruining its quality. To do that, go to bigjpg.com. This is the best AI image enlarger so far. So just upload your image. Click on start to select its image style, upscaling resolution, and the noise reduction. After that, click on OK and just wait for it. Now that it's downloaded, as you can see, it is now bigger than the original image. And if we try to zoom it in with the same percentage, the enlarged one is really bigger. So now that we have a higher resolution, let's now proceed to the compilation of the coloring pages to make it a book. You can use any editing applications, but for beginners, you can use Canva. It is beginner friendly. Once you're here, click on create a design. I will choose custom size since I want 8.5 by 11 inches pages. Now here, go to the left panel and click on upload. Select your images and arrange it per page. The first one could be your title and follow your mid-journey generated images. Now I will add in a blank page each coloring page that we have. This is to prevent the bleeding if ever the buyer will use markers to color our book. After you upload it all, you can utilize other tools in here to design your book. Once you're done, click on save. Save it as PDF print and then choose CMYK for best printing results. Now that we have our coloring book pages, the next thing to do is to create a cover of the book. To make sure that our sizing is right, visit the KDP Amazon cover converter, input the details of your book in here, and then after that, click on calculate dimensions. Here is the required size of our book cover. This will prevent our cover from being cutted once it's printed. So go back to Canva, create a design, select custom size, and copy what the cover calculator provided to us. And here we can use Midjourney again to generate the cover image. So this is what I got. Paste that in here. Make sure to put it on the right part and make sure to have the same background color for the back of your book cover. To do that, click on this color box, select the eyedrop tool and put it on the background of your image. Now edit the image. You can use chat GPT for your book description at the back. And once that's done, download it again as PDF print and then CMYK. Now the last thing to do is to upload it on KDP Amazon. Once you're in here, click on create, choose paperback, input its title, proceed to the subtitle, author, description. Again, you can use ChatGPT to make this one for you. Make sure to own your work. Add in keywords that will make your book easier to search. Select category and if you're done here, click on save and continue. Now in this next page is the printing details. So first get free ISBN. Input the publication date that you want. Choose the printing options. So we just need black and white since this is a coloring book. Choose the size, no bleed. Choose cover finish. So I want it glossy but you can also use matte. Now upload your coloring book pages and the coloring book cover. Preview once it's loaded. And tap on apply once you're satisfied with the placement of your cover and pages. After that, click on save and continue. And in here, set the price. Publish the book now. It will take 2 to 5 business days, but you will then be notified once your book is published. So that is how to create coloring books fast with Midjourney for Amazon KDP. Do let us know if this video helped you out. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop them down below. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.